welcome back to another video and today we're back on the requiem server to continue our journey for the best possible base that i can make in a cave this is once again a natural cave last time i focused on making this which is my enchanting area and i got some feedback from the other people on the server and i should replace this diorite so that's what i'm going to be doing today to start off first things first though I need glass, pew. Quite a bit of glass. I need glass, I need gray glass blocks. So, I have the bones to do it. I need more ink sacks though, so I'm heading off to do that. Let's do this. Um, yep, this is the lake. At least that's what I call it. That's a lot of ink sets. I'm gonna grab 10. Yep, this is the populated area of them. There are so many squids in this area. I'm not even kidding. That should be enough for now. And before I forget, why don't we start the episode by doing this. Pancake poultry. Boom. 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 There we go. This is a baby. This is a baby. Anyways, uh, so basically what you need to do is place in an ink sack and you'll get black dye. Place in a bone and you'll get bone meal. Place in bone meal and you'll get white dye. Mix these two together and you'll get gray dye. Okay, back to this. Toss those in there. Toss those in there. Boom. Boom. Oh. Boom. Boom. Oh! I'm gonna take that lead. There's another one of these guys out here. Where's that the villager? Oh, it wasn't a villager. It was a wandering trader. Okay. No, I don't want that. I want my lead back. Okay, back inside to go and grab myself some gray glass. So, I need to melt more glass and then I will be able to successfully make the gray dye, the gray glass. Basically, here's what I want to do. I want to go one, two, three, four, five, six, I just need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I just need twelve pieces of gray glass to place in, instead of this diorite to look like rubber cement, which is what glass is usually held by. Go in, place it around the edge, place a piece of dye in the middle, and you get eight pieces of glass. I actually need to do that twice. Even though I only need nine, it only gives you eight. So, yeah. So basically, let's get started by doing this side. There we go. So now that's what that looks like. Okay, moving on, this side. Boom, boom, boom. 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 Okay, let's continue. Yes, good, okay. No! Place it with an andesite. Eh, let's make it more natural. Boom. 
piece of iron ore right in there and there we go. Rubber cement has been placed in. There is still diorite in the corners. Mixed with some andesite to give it some na a natural sort of feel. But now it looks slightly better. Using efficiency two, I'm going to start mining out a bedroom area. Okay, so basically, my bedroom, my bed is going to be right here. And then I'm going to make more bookshelves to put right here, like four bookshelves to put right there. Okay, let's check the lighting level right here. Okay, good. It doesn't go below six. It doesn't go below seven, which means no mobs can spawn in this area. Eventually, I want to place lanterns in instead of torches because it'll look better. But for now, this will work. Um, so now I'm going to do a this thing I like to do called a gradient, or at least I call it a gradient. Basically, what I do is this. It's just going to go down a couple of blocks. Lots of granite under my restaurant. It's daytime now because they were burning. Okay, so let's check some more light levels. Ah, right here. Um, that should be good. Yep. Up, oh, no, nope, this corner. Ooh, actually, I can fix that right now. There we go. We got a couple more pieces. Place in some iron ore to look at more natural. Yeah, that looks good. Okay. Then I actually need. Yeah, look at that. Eh. I'm going to move these a little bit. There we go. That looks nice. Nice. That looks nice. There we go. That should look good. Okay. Let's fill in this area right here. Place some random stone. Around. And that should give it a natural feel. There we go. Okay, now I'm gonna fill in this wall so that it looks natural. Natural, but it looks like somebody's also been was mining down here and found this area. Let's get started on the actual bedroom. Replace the bed, and then I'm gonna place item frames around the bed. And then a wood. I need wood. Signs. Useful. Signs. I need normal wood. I have coal in here. Please. I have enough stuff. I don't have any wood. That's a lot of wool, though. Um. Well, okay then. I need two wool anyways, so. Yeah. If you're wondering why I need two wool, it's because I need carpets. I also need two white wool for two more carpets. OK. 
Okay, so. There we go. Oh, I need leather. Almost forgot to get leather. First things first, we need... We need to get ourselves some more... Of these. Okay, so I'm gonna bring a crafting table down here because I don't like having to go all the way back up anytime I need anything. So basically what you do is this. And you take your signs and you place them like that and you can still set your spawn and stuff. Um, I'm gonna need one more, I believe. Yeah, one more. So, now that we have all of our item frames in place, now we just need to put in all the signs. I only need two more. Okay, so now that I'm done with this, this is the last part. Place a carpet on top. And then this on top as well. There you go. You just kidding. You don't need a carpet on it. On it. it looks dumb if it's like that. Okay. Now basically, you just need some pressure plates. Place a pressure plate there, 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 and there. And then you use the mystical power of right clicking to turn them around. No, we bet. There we go. Now we have drawers on our bed as well. So now that our bed is done, we can set our spawn here. Slash home. set home. And just like that, I have completed the first part of my bedroom. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, that's the bedroom partially completed. I'm gonna head out now. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.